The shooting happened at 5 a.m., the first time an Oakland policeman has been killed in nearly 20 years. Newton had not gone out looking to shoot police. There was an altercation, but this time, a policeman was dead and a black man was alive. That hadn't happened. The suspect is Huey Newton, 25-year-old leader of the Black Panthers for self-defense. They were trying to kill us, and it was up to us to defend ourselves. He wanted to change everything as the revolutionary, as the leader of protest. If he was convicted, he would probably be executed. There's no question. He's, he's done for. We had to get Huey a lawyer. And all the black Nazis groups said, you can't have a white lawyer. No lawyer that I knew had even talked about fighting the criminal justice system. The jury selection in the Huey Newton trial was revolutionary. It was clear that the prosecutor wanted to get all the blacks off. At the time of the Newton trial, prosecutors had a lot of latitude to exclude people of color. He thought he could just tell the jury, look, this is a cop killing, but the case wasn't that simple. What was going to happen in Oakland when he was convicted? We would resort to warfare on the streets. If he, he made the first shot, obviously he was armed. Man has a right to defend himself. He would swivel around, start talking to the jury, educating the jury about our movement. Huey wanted to show how unfair the judicial system was. The long-awaited decision in the Huey Newton murder trial is now very near. Everyone was prepared for there to be a big blow-up. 